The government of Zain Dusha is promoting the development of affordable and clean renewable energy alternatives, an action which will aid in meeting sustainable development goal number seven. During the budget presentation, Prime Minister Honorable Alan Chastney announced a number of measures to be implemented as part of the national strategy aimed at reducing fossil fuel dependence and improving St. Lucia's overall competitiveness in the energy sector. In this regard, I am pleased to inform Honorable Members that LUSLEC has secured the resources from Abu Dhabi Fund for Development to allow the installation of a 10 megawatt solar farm with 6 megawatt battery storage in the Trumase Mikud area. Also during this financial year, Mr. Speaker, an allocation has been made for the installation of at least 100 kilowatt or solar PV systems and 10 schools across the island. As part of efforts to promote energy efficiency, the Prime Minister says audits will be conducted at 40 schools and lighting retrofits of over 6,700 fluorescent lights will be changed to LED in selected schools. A similar exercise will be undertaken with respect to our street lights, most of which will be replaced with LED lights, thereby resulting in further energy savings. Mr. Speaker, to assist with the maintenance of our PV systems, the government has embarked on a program to train and certify a number of PV installers and inspectors so as to support and encourage the use of this form of renewable energy. Honorable Alan Chastney says consultation will also begin on a proposal for the introduction of energy efficiency legislation which will provide guidelines and promote efficient energy utilization.